Thank you for taking the time. A lot has happened for your rifle team, another President's Cup, and uh, you had a couple of uh, rifleists go to the World Championships. Tell me about how what things have been going on. Well, we had two qualify as juniors going to the World Championships, and they were in Cairo, Egypt. So that was a long trip, a big trip. Uh, we had a couple miss quite a few days of class. So we were planning, as, as soon as we realized we, were, we had some uh, team members going, we started planning academically and then also with uh, – you know, the rest of our matches during that time. But uh, Scott Rocket and Penina uh, D'Souza made it, and they both shot actually very well there. Scott shot, you know, for the junior men's team, and they they took a, a bronze medal. So that was very exciting because uh, they've changed that competition where you compete head-to-head you know, for, with the fourth, you know, somebody's going to come in fourth and someone's going to come in third. And then again, the, the other teams that are competing for the gold medal, you know, silver and uh, gold are competing head to head. So it becomes a very intense competition. And our uh, American boys did well in that part of it and, and came home with a, a bronze medal. And really, um, Scott came in ninth overall. Uh, our two shooters, they shot a 599 and a 598 over there. And in collegiate ranks, that's very good shooting. Okay, well, Penina came in 33rd. You know, so uh, when you start getting into the decimal scoring that they use uh, at the international level, we have a little work to do. Uh, so every tenth counts, and it's a, it's a, an intense match. But again, you're rubbing shoulders with the best shooters in the world. So we feel pretty good about that experience and how that will help lead them into hopefully competing for the U.S. and maybe even our Olympic team. Yeah, well, it certainly led you in well to the President's Cup because uh, you guys took it again, the ninth year in a row that Air Force – uh, better than the other service academies. Yeah, well, uh, thanks. Uh, proud of that, obviously. Uh, and it, I have to say, you know, for the President's Cup, uh, it's it's scored a little bit differently. So each team can pick eight shooters total, and the top five scores then go into the team match for both small bore and air. So uh, where uh, in collegiate, the, the coaches pick the, the five team members and the top four scores count. Now, a lot, everybody has really a chance to be a counter. And believe it or not, everybody on our team was a counter in one of the five slots for either small bore or air. So we needed the whole team, and we beat uh, Navy by about 20, and I think Army by about 60. So, you know, we're, uh, we're that, while that, was, that feels good, uh, you know, we still need to focus on the scores we need to make it to nationals. So uh, we're a little bit behind where we want to be, but, you know, it's a good good place to, to build from right now, now that we've kind of recovered from Cairo and uh, really understand where where we're shooting and what we need to work on. It doesn't hurt to have a Scott Rocket and a Penina D'Souza, though, who are uh, – are there are their scores staying up that high as they shot in Cairo? Uh, well, they a little bit of a dip, a little bit of a dip, but, again, uh, we're shooting – when we go to an, a match, we shoot two days in a row, two full days, and we're still working on building that endurance. And yeah, when we go to the nationals, we shoot small bore one day and air rifle the next day, so it's not quite uh, the endurance game that we're, that I'm making them, you know, perform through right now. But we do know we need to work on endurance. And in two weeks, we'll be going to Akron, mm-hmm. and uh, that'll be where the uh, national championships are held this year. Again, it won't be the, in the exact same. Uh, range, but at least we'll get a, a lay of the land. So if we do make that championship, we'll, we'll have a little feel for the area and uh, what we need to be prepared for. And then on Sunday, we'll shoot against Ohio State and then uh, return home. So uh, we do need to continue to work on endurance. It'll be a very good match. Both those teams are you know, right with us average-wise. So uh, we got to bring our A game and uh, you know, put, it, put uh, the rubber on the road. Perfect. Lonnie Miley, thank you for the time. Congrats again on another President's Cup. Appreciate it. Thanks so much.